Hey guys, what's going on? I'm Savior from Noobs, and first of all, before I get into this video, I'd like to thank you, Dansby, for allowing me to upload to this channel. I don't know if it's going to be posted or not, but if not, thank you for viewing it anyways, and if it is, thank you even more. So, this is a game with the PDW, yeah, 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 I know, it's on Hijacked, and it's a headquarters game. I only get, I think, 58 kills or something like that, I'm not sure. But, it's a fast paced gameplay and I cut out all the tedious deaths and stuff like that so like if no, there's nothing happened that there's nothing that happened in a life I just exited out and skipped it same with all of the uh, capturing and stuff like that cut most of that out okay this is my first commentary with music actually being played in the background it's really quiet so it should be fine I don't know I'll test it out after I'm done recording this so yep yeah. So again, thank you Dansby for allowing me to upload to this channel. What I'd like to talk to you guys today about is... What I'd like to talk to you guys today about... I don't know how to say that, but anyways. I'd like to talk to you guys about community channels and how can they can affect the community. I know that Dansby got famous off of... Well, YouTube famous more or less off of... Uh, Thunderstruck Gaming, which is a thing that I uploaded to at one point, but he never accepted it because I just started it recently and I'm not that great at commentating yet. And yeah, so basically I've just been looking around looking for different channels and I remember that Dansby, who I subscribed to on a really earlier channel that I had before, and I've checked it out. I'm like, oh cool, he turned this into a community channel. Might as well try and upload to it. And if you see me now, then I guess I uploaded to it. <laughs> okay. So community channels, they can affect the community very much because they can cause people's downfalls and like biggest achievements and everything like that. You can look at Dansby, he got pop, he got insanely popular off of Thunderstruck Gaming because he's a good commentator. But then you look at people like Advanced UAV, who just got famous off of hate. That's not how you want to get going, but that's what I mean. But the downfall of community channels is that if your commentators and stuff isn't good, like, like I did just there, my commentators isn't good, you're not going to get very far and you might not even get accepted but if it does get upset accepted up not obsexted <laughs> jeez accepted uh, then and well and like your commentary is really bad it's gonna be really like you're gonna have a really bad time trying to get big because people are know you for that one commentary on the channel and they'll always refer they'll always think I'll use myself as an example Oh god, I remember seeing Chaos on, like, that guy Chaos SFN on uh, It's Dansby's channel, and god, he was so awful. I couldn't even imagine being that bad. I mean, I just even started, and I'm still not, I mean, I've, I've never been as bad as him. So yeah, that's basically how people will react. So whenever you're doing stuff like this, you want to be careful about what you're talking about and how you come across and everything like that. I know that I'm not the most cheerful person or everything like that, but this is how I talk in real life. And I can't exactly change how my voice is because it's just different. It's harder to change how my voice is. This is actually a really nice kill. I throw at the hunter killer and then I get him because he was camping because he was head glitching. And yeah, then I die. So what was I talking about? Oh yeah, no, no, I can't remember. Oh, well, we'll move on. So yeah, basically, what is good about these channels is that you can get really big off of them, but you can also have your downfalls as I've said before. I think I just came across of what I finished talking about last time, and that was um, giving, having good commentary and stuff like that for these channels because you can't get very far and yeah I already explained this earlier in the video so I don't know why I'm explaining it again if you would like to tell me down in the comments please go ahead because I don't know what the heck's going on up in my mind and yeah okay so after that uh, since I'm pretty much done talking about commentaries and stuff like that I might as well tell you guys a little bit about my channel 
on my channel, well, basically, I am a 14-year-old, almost 15-year-old commentator from Canada. I'm not going to give you more specific details, even though I have in my videos before, so I don't know. And I like to post and record videos of me playing video games. I have so many series going on on my channel right now, and like I have Castle Crashers, I I haven't really gotten that far into it. I've recently started doing Minecraft Infected, I have Call of Duty gameplays, I have Far Cry 3 gameplays, Far Cry 3 playthrough, a Borderlands 2 co-op playthrough, and all that, and, and much more to come. I just recently up started uploading in like late December, probably around 28th. I think. And yeah, that's pretty much all about me. If you want to come out and check out my channel, I'm pretty sure my thing will be down in the description. And yeah. So I go talk to you guys and win. And I'd also like to thank Dan Spee so much again for allowing me to upload to this channel. It's a great honor, but if it doesn't get uploaded, I'd still like to thank you guys. I'll thank Dan Spee for watching the video. I enjoy all your videos, and, well, yeah, this is a headquarters game, I think 56 and 20 something, I don't know, I cut out like 10 of the deaths, and the gameplay's coming to an end, guys, uh, I might see you guys over at my channel if you feel like it, and be sure to give Dan be a bunch of likes, bunch of subscribes on his channel for allowing me to upload this, thank you guys, talk to you guys later, peace. Down, move up. Uh, uh.